Hi, in this screencast we're going to talk about setting the border style to a box. In the CSS uh, box model, this is the second layer wrapping the content box. Uh, CSS allows you quite a few selections to style your border and in addition it allows you to style each of the four sides individually. Okay, and I'll show you how right now. Let's open up our CSS folder and let's look at this index.html with top style. And you can see here that I have a uh, HTML file with um, style sheet set up. Okay, uh, this first class is called individual sides. Okay, uh, the way you set up your uh, CSS border style to each individual sides is by doing border dash the side which is top right here and then dash and then style uh, and then colon then you get to choose uh, the type of um, styles you want okay so let's take this out and let's try it again so uh, these are the choices you got a none dotted dash solid double groove ridge inset outset and hidden so I chose solid for this one I chose um, uh, dotted for the right border I chose groove for the bottom border I chose double for the left uh, border okay so if I apply this uh, individual sides class to uh, this div okay uh, this is just one div with the line of text. Okay, uh, all these styles would be applied to uh, the top, right, bottom, left of uh, this box. Okay, and but before we apply this, uh, let's save it. Okay, minimize it. Let's uh, look at what we have in the browser first. Okay, so we have just a line of text. You don't see that box, that the div that's uh, that contains this line of text, because it doesn't have any borders. Okay, we didn't set it up yet. Okay, uh, what I want to show you is uh, the layout of the box model. Uh, I'm going to hit F12. Uh, this is the Firebug. I'm going to inspect this box. Okay, and the layout of it. So what we're interested in in this screencast is this second layer okay which is the border you see now it's all zero uh, along four sides uh, that's because we didn't set anything up yet okay so let's minimize it bring back top style and uh, let's apply this individual sides class let's just copy oops let's type it in because it's uh, outside of the page. Okay, individual sides. Save it, minimize it, bring back Firefox, and then refresh. So borders have been applied to all four sides of this box. You see its top is solid. The right border is dotted bottom border is groove and the left border is double you see a double line okay and uh, let's minimize it so that's how you would set up uh, each of the sides using um, four line commands okay however uh, you can uh, set it to um, do the whole uh, do these four lines and combine it into a one line style uh, I made a second class called all sides uh, you can do border dash style okay uh, leave out the the side uh, in the middle okay and just do border style okay and uh, in CSS whenever you have these uh, four elements or, or four settings uh, it's always from top to left so this would be top style this would be right style this would be bottom style and this would be left style so it's top top 
right, bottom, left, clockwise. Okay, starting from the top. So uh, if I do this, okay, this would have the same result as this. Okay, let me minimize it, bring back Firefox, and just show you. Refresh a couple times, and it looks the same because I set the same style. Okay, and uh, if you want all four sides to be just solid, okay, or just one uh, same style, all you have to do is just do this: border style solid, and all four sides are going to be have the same style. Okay, let's minimize it, bring back Firefox, and then refresh. You see that all four sides are solid now. Okay, so that's uh, setting CSS border style. Okay, that's it for this screencast. Thank you.